what's up guys welcome to another video if you're tuning in make sure to like and subscribe i really appreciate it we're doing a little modifications to the w210 mercedes benz uh 2001 uh putting a little taste on it so let's get into the video i'm gonna change the brake rotors the brakes and i'm gonna change the springs out uh, with some lowering springs i got the kit right here and i got one of the springs right there as you can see um so first thing first uh, i got my tools that i'm gonna need i'm gonna have to, to push the spring first and then remove the shock and let's get to it the one on the left the one on the right is the one we putting in, look at the difference. Um, it's pretty wild. So we finally got the spring in, it's nice and tight. We still gotta tighten down our shock right here. But man, I had to make sure that the spring was really compressed uh, in order to uh, get over this little bump. And uh, right here, but man, we got it. And uh, we're gonna be you know, changing the brakes, but it might not be now. But it might be some other time. I might not even change it under the video. Uh, I might. I don't know. Depending. But man, looking glorious right now. Both sides. Now I'm finna um, put the brakes, the rotors on. Uh, right now, I had to move uh, the clip right here. Um, the plugs for the cover. Uh, I think it's an 8 millimeter uh, in here. Uh, about one and two on the back side. I to crack those off and then uh, keep going from there. But I'm not going to go with all in detail. I'm going to see the transformation. Um, so uh, let's get it. Break caliper off. As you can see, there's rust. Man, it was like made it to the server, so I finally had got a hammer and stuff and knocked the hell out of it. Um, it took some time, but I got it. But good thing I got some copper spray. I think I got me a, um, a, a, a wire brush uh, that attached to the drill, so I might as well just clean the surface off and then just attach um, copper on it and then put new brakes and stuff on. Man, we got both sides done. We got both sides done. I could have went with coilovers and stuff. I might have to change this shop. Uh, or is it good? But I'm, I might end up changing it sometime. But as of right now, man, we about to drop this car low. But look at it, man. Look at the wheel set up, man. It's sick, man. So guys, I am doing the rear uh, brakes. And the brake pads. If I ain't uh, doing this year, I'm about to change out the spring and put in the rear spring. But I'm finna go spend time with some people. And it ain't bad at all. Uh, what I had to do is uh, loosen that a little bit. And I had to use, I used like a socket with um, my jack to hold up against it. So when the bolt uh, loose, it still stays in place and I can slowly uh, bring it down instead of like just not loosen anything just pop down and stuff and then I had to compress the spring too before I actually took it out but I had to loosen it uh, compress the spring as you can see and then go down but man I'm gonna see the transformation after this I'm gonna have to do the same side what's up guys what's up so after installing the lowering springs uh, my new brakes and the rotors uh, the car, I came and put like a finger barely in there, as you can see, I barely can. But uh, I know when it's like on level ground, I can fit these two. But uh, the 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 side, the front had dropped, but it's still a little high. But it dropped, it dropped, um, which is crazy. But man, the wheels look beautiful. Uh, got these wheels off of car d i got this whole the whole package uh cost me about 2400 so um the car been driving so well and very nimble and stuff still have the same driving characteristics 
um, as before. Uh, like I said in the video, I might get coilovers in the near future, or I might get some Bilstein shocks. But right now, I ain't concerned with that. Uh, with the rear, uh, like I said, if it's on level ground, the back, you can see it drop. Like, you can see it uh, drop and all that. But I also did the same on the back side and stuff. But yeah, you kind of can see on this side, like I said, I'm, <laughs> Way like the my drive way is and stuff is kind of like at a hill and stuff. So, but uh, man, look, looks so sick. And uh, all the way I'm gonna add power to this car, which we're gonna disclose to this video uh, next video. You got to stay tuned uh, for that. But man, she look beautiful. I'm really pleased with it. Uh, I want to do like a little small cosmetic stuff uh, to it uh, in the near future. But y'all stay tuned, man. Um, we got little stuff I need to fix on this Mercedes, and I'm gonna record videos and um, show uh, show y'all stuff. So let's get to it. <clears throat> so these are the rear springs. You can see the big, slight difference. We are on the last wheel, guys. We're on the last wheel. Fingers crossed. Might end up going to the gas. Well, give me a washer and I'm going to go to the gas station. So, man, it's going to be a blast. So guys, as you can see, I ain't really, I ain't went too detail on how I did the process, but if I ever have to, I will. But like I said, I just uh, compressed the springs, um, loosen some bolts just to put in the new lowering springs, change the brakes and the rotors, which was super easy, but it was kind of a pain and stuff. I had to use a damn hammer because it was like seized up and rusted. I used some copper spray uh, to like eliminate that if I ever had to take them off again but um it's not bad um at all it's pretty easy uh what else i think that's pretty much it man just like i just said uh stay tuned and i'm proud and with the porsche man we got some we got some stuff we need to do to it man uh, i'm gonna drop i'm gonna drop a video on the porsche itself uh the tahoe itself then the mercedes itself and then on my four-wheeler channel, I ain't been, I took a break, but I ain't getting much on the Renegade yet, so I need to, but hey, y'all stay tuned, man. Thank y'all. Um, make sure y'all hit that sub and let's go. I mean, we gotta start from somewhere. Um, just wanna share my cars and stuff that I got and possibly get uh, more in the near future and stuff. But uh, I'm gonna work with uh, what I got and be content. All paid off and stuff is really well. But each car got a story and stuff, so I'm gonna tell you how I got it and so forth and all that. But hey, let's get to it. <laughs>